whole Gen 3 Akuma idea and go with something else. And that idea was to make custom bloodlines for the community and the community uh, based bloodlines that they wanted to see. And even a custom bloodline, someone just wants in the game for themselves. And that's the route they wanted to take. Now, stuff that they've done like that, kind of like, is bloodlines like I have in the game, Xeno Doke. I know you guys remember the bloodline that was named after me. Um, I didn't have any say in this. Uh, I do appreciate this bloodline uh, being named after me. That was pretty cool of them to do. So, shout out to Real Games for that. Um, other bloodlines like I think um, Aiden, yeah, Aiden Sun Mud. I think that's someone on the uh, team, the balancing team. That uh, variety, uh, Jay Ramaki. There we go. Variety J's bloodline that was named after him, which is actually pretty cool as well. Stuff like that. But this time we're able to completely choose the moves of it, the mode of it and stuff like that. Basically use our creativity to make a bloodline that we want in the game. And they're going to try to do it, which I think is actually a pretty sick idea. Definitely a way to engage with the community, uh, show appreciation to the community as well so that's a w from the rail games uh rail brothers themselves i definitely think let me know what you guys think of that but right now i'm gonna show you guys what they said on twitter we're gonna take a look at some of the people's suggestions on all of this so let's get straight to it so here we are it says retweet and like community final bloodlines challenge post the bloodline concept down below bloodline concept the name of the bloodline could even be named after yourself abilities and powers you'd like to see rarity and you'll get the bloodline if you came up with the concept so as you guys see this is what they're talking about man and people are actually digging this they're going in bro they are going in i really do like to see this kind of type of stuff from the community as a lot of people viewed their twitter which a lot of people know about it um, has some likes and retweets as well. So there's this guy, um, so non rail Guinness. He had custom Akuma and customer Goku. Uh, customize your Akuma and it shows the moves that he put as well. So it's kind of like the the Akuma, uh, Akuma we already have in the game. Basically, we get to customize like different types of stuff for like the ninjutsus and mode and stuff like that. So that's pretty cool. Um, let's see. Sand Guard, a sand bloodline similar to Scorch that provides defense and support for allies. First move, sand orb. Second, sand shield. Third, sand suspension. C1 mode, create sand castle for team support. C2 mode, turns castle into golem for attacking. Now, this is really creative, and this man can draw, bro. That is sick. That is sick. They're going all out with this. Like, for real, for real. Is a sand castle or tower that gives you and your allies in a, a area sand shield based on the players your point five base HP. That would be that, that that would be really good for like Shindo World. But yeah, this thing is really creative. In the sand golem that he was talking about, that is sick. Let me know what y'all think of that. Then they even made the freaking bloodline logo, bro. That is sick. That is sick. Then we got Prism. Shout out to that boy Prism. He calls this Akuma Joke got pictures of him then the description of it um let me see if you put it joke akuma first mode standard joke combat c-spec teleporting counter a Cezano arm slams the ground around the attacker q-spec a dash skill that leads it to a fist barrage second mode half body susano image provided below a bluish white color susano with twin line fist and c-spec and eight triagram appears and turn the susano slams the ground causing an explosion similar to joke's or rocky uh joke's third c-spec Rarity one out of 270. So yeah, this is the logo for it. That's pretty cool as well. And then we got the other three moves for it and the drawing. But yeah, creativity. Creativity, man. Uh Naramaki Prime. Mix of all the Naramaki themed bloodlines, including Getsuga. That's that would be something I feel like Rail Games would have done. This is a very much a Rail Games type of bloodline, you know what I mean? So I, I feel like this definitely will become a thing of the game. Uh, in the name of it, Naramaki Prime, like, come on. Come on, bro. Onaji, Joke slash Baramaki Gaiden, the competitor of Kamaki Akuma, and also, you need a new Joke. Facts. So, look at this. 
I would read it over, but I don't want to just like keep talking. But some of these are actually pretty cool. The Rasengan Cutter, that's sick. Rengoku Purloin. The names of the abilities are nice too. In that logo, bro, that is sick. That is sick. Shout out to them. Uh, Nightmare Akuma. That's that's cool. Kaito Akuma. Can sleep on the whole night to edit this. Shindo Buckleus will be complete if we get a bloodline. Oh, that is. Then he made a whole video for it too. Oh my God! Hold on, he went in. He went in. The ability reverses your opponent in its HP. I didn't get to read it, but second ability. Water style, quiet sea. Let's see what he's talking about. Shout out for him for making this too. Okay. Basically, the player lets out big waves of water on the ground. If the opponent gets touched, they get stunned by it. They get slashed multiple times. Inspired by Giyu's 11th form. Yeah, I kind of guessed that. That was sick. That was sick. So yeah, let me let me know what y'all think some of these uh, guys' suggestions for bloodlines in the game. Joe K. Alchemist, so another person saying the same thing, which looks pretty cool. I ain't even gonna lie. Like, look at this. Their drawings are so amazing. Shout out to the people that's commenting under this, man. Shout out to y'all for this challenge. I call it Sayugane. 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 It's pretty cool. So it's Tuyuya's bloodline from Naruto. That's pretty nice. But yeah, a lot of people commenting. Pretty, pretty cool. Ooh, Kaijin Sabru. Hold up. That logo for it is fire. I ain't even gonna lie, that logo for it is fire. Then he has all the moves for it too. Feel free to pause and look at this yourself, but let me know what y'all think about that. Let's see if we can find one more. One more. Uh... Yin Yang Joke. Oh! That, that looks so nice. I ain't gonna lie, that looks sick. Yin Yang Joke. Bro's been trying to get these added for months now. If he has been, that would be dope. That would be dope. But yeah, stuff like this. This is what they were talking about, bro. And everybody's going crazy trying to suggest stuff like this. And I respect it, bro. I respect it. Let me know what you guys think about this. Hit the like button, subscribe. It's your boys here into the tire and I'm out, man. Hold me I honestly feel like a cocky when I'm coming up proving no one can fuck with me. This is my prophecy, Biju Kurama, we bonded together, you see my nine tail piece. Woke up, trip like a kage. Sharma got hand on the do what I say. Feel like I'm cover yo with the god play. Kurama kill him up on your villain demon foxes. Switch up and when I pin a pin up your dad. If you fuckin' with me, I'd tell you less of regrets. They gon' fall when I show how I lit up the rest. While I flow, I'm the go bitch.